Hello everyone, welcome back to Two Minute Tips. Let's get started. If you've never heard of JavaScript or CSS before, then it is likely that you've never used your custom coding options in a Qualtrics survey. Generally speaking, JavaScript is a programming language that is used alongside HTML and CSS to create websites. Qualtrics has certain areas where this code can be added to your survey so you can customize it how you'd like. Today we will go over where to find the JavaScript editor and remind you where to add your custom CSS. We will be using code from two posts from the XM community. Before continuing this video, please note that our support team does not offer any assistance or consultation on custom coding. The best way to get help on custom coding is by asking a question on the XM community. Let's begin by opening our survey and going into the look and feel tab. Once we're there, we'll head over to the style section, scroll down and click edit on the custom CSS box. Now we can go to the XM community post that contains the custom CSS code, highlight, copy, paste, click save, and click apply. You will notice that nothing has changed in the look and feel preview, but if we go into our survey builder and click preview, we will see a beautiful gradient added to our survey background. Now let's go back to our survey builder and begin adding a new flat picker calendar question by creating a new text entry question. Once we've done that, to reach the JavaScript editor, we will select the question, scroll down to question behavior, and click the JavaScript button. Just like the last code, we will go to our XM community post, copy the code, paste it, make any edits we want, and click save. For this specific situation, we have to add the style sheet reference by going into the look and feel tab, going to the general section, and clicking edit on the header text box. Once we're there, click the source code icon, copy and paste the code, click save, and click apply. Now we can go to our survey builder, click preview, and see how our calendar question looks when we interact with it. As we can see, Flatpicker creates a calendar UI that allows us to conveniently choose a specific date. And that's it. Thank you for learning how to add custom code to a Qualtrics survey with me today. Please remember to subscribe to the two minute tip category on the XM community so you never miss a video. And I hope to see you around the XM community.